Ballard, who's now rumored to be launching a Senate bid, quote, saved 123 people, 55 of which were children on one mission alone. Joining me now is Lynn Packer, an award-winning investigative reporter who has been covering Tim Ballard since 2014. Thanks very much for coming on the program. Appreciate it. So um, Vice News reporting that the number of women making allegations expected to go higher than seven. What do we know about that? Well, that's consistent with my reporting. The number of seven, eight women surfaced quite a long time ago, but it was not reported. Uh, reporters got that information on deep background. The numbers came up during a criminal investigation that was begun in August of uh, 2020, it was three years ago, but uh, there was no reporting about that. The, they, the investigators interviewed a lot of women Apparently, some of the alleged uh, victims or people who uh, knew about it at that time. But the investigation was focused on whether Utah's communications fraud statute had been violated, not on any sexual misconduct. What exactly are the allegations? I mean, you know, sexual misconduct is a kind of broad term. Are we talking about allegations of sexual harassment? Are we talking about allegations of sexual assault? They range from unwanted overtures, uh, solicitations, and in some cases, allegedly, the women just turned it down. Uh, then it ranges all the way up to actual affairs, some of them reportedly with married women. Um, and people who were working with the organization, right? So clearly, the organization or he believed that there was a reason for him to separate from the organization, right? I mean, he's denying all the allegations, but either he or the organization determined that it was in the best interest for them to part ways. Right. I mentioned in my report is that uh, it's always a possibility that the board erred on the side of caution, was unable to definitively prove that these allegations were true and said, well, this is going to be hanging over our CEO, so let's force him out. Uh, what is more likely is that they were satisfied that some of these complaints were accurate. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your cable provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.